Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Grizzos Cards. We are back at cross country practice. Just got off work, got a few minutes before my son's going to be done. So I'm going to rip my last 2021 Topps Chrome Platinum Anniversary Mega Box. Uh, remember I got like eight of these around my birthday. They were 25 bucks a piece. Uh, started off hot with the gold prisms and some autos, but been pretty cold since. So hopefully we can go out with a bang. Uh, so eight packs, four cards per pack. All right, let's get into it. Uh, so just some random thoughts while I'm doing this. Starting off, we got Blue Prism coming up in this pack. Uh, so baseball season, uh, regular season coming to a close. <laughs> Big bad Bobby Doll back on the Blue Prism. He's not on our team right now. Uh, so the Reds fired. David Bell on Sunday, uh, which I guess wasn't too surprising. I don't think he necessarily did a bad job. Uh, Reds just had a lot of injuries this year. So I think it's kind of scapegoat. Just find it odd that they fired him with five games to go. So I don't know. Basically, like, sorry, David, uh, you don't get to come on the last road trip of the season. Uh, my thinking is... They must have somebody in mind that they think might get fired from another team. And that's why they wanted to just have their position open. So we'll see. Javier Baez shows up in every single pack. I don't know what's going on. We got Christian Vasquez, Refractor, and Yerman Mercedes on the prism. So next Reds manager, I don't know. Um, there's always going to be speculation about Barry Larkin, which... My all-time favorite player, I think he'd probably do a good job. Um, but if things do go south like they usually do in Cincinnati, it would just be awkward if he were to get fired. Um, so I think I, I'll have mixed emotions about that. If he's considered, I've heard, you know, if the Yankees go out early and Aaron Boone gets fired there, that maybe the Reds would reunite with him. So just some thoughts, but... Uh, I know Jonathan India said to the media the other day that the Reds need to make a move. Um, they absolutely do. They need to spend some money this offseason. Um, the time is to win now. we got to get everybody healthy. Um, I just think we have a few years with Ellie before the Yankees or Dodgers are going to throw a ton of money at them. So we do have a Jose Altuve mini diamond. That's going to be numbered. Oh, 70. So that's a nice one there. So I don't want to lose Ellie, but I think if we don't win a uh, few years, he's probably going to be gone. So that's my thought on the red situation. We'll see how this plays out the rest of the season or off season. Jim Bunning, nice. Got a nice Tom Glavin prism there. So I've seen these boxes on blowout recently they're up like $34.99 so I'm not sure who in the 2021 rookie class is maybe driving up the prices it seems like 2021 products have started to go up a little bit and we have a JT Brubaker refractor so if you know 2021 I mean Alec Bohm is decent but I don't think the hobby's going nuts for him uh, Jazz with the Yankees maybe I don't know no more Mazzara, Chris Taylor, Kopech, and Nelson Cruz. So coming up on channel, I'm probably going to start, definitely there's still be ripping baseball. I want the NBA is going to be, season's going to be here in less than a month. So uh, definitely ripping some more basketball. I need to get more football. And I'm going to finish out this box. I think it's not going to be that great. Jake Cronenworth, Luis Urias, and we have our last prison refractor is going to be Zach McKinstry, rookie. So uh, definitely the big hit is going to be the Jose Altuve out of 70. So uh, that's going to do it for these. Again, I, I, if I see these boxes for 25 bucks or a hobby box is back around 75, I'll definitely pick up some more. But let me know what you thought. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time. Have a good one.